Hi everyone, I'm Jackie Oliver. I am a first year student at NWAC. I am minoring in criminology and majoring in criminal justice. And what I would like to talk to you about today is unprofessionalism and unfair treatment in the workplace and the issues that there are around that and some suggestions that I have to fix it. So without naming names or companies, I'm gonna be telling some stories and some personal experiences that I've had with it. Just to kind of give you an idea of what I mean. Unprofessionalism in the workplace can relate to a few different things. It can be sexual harassment, it could be discrimination, whether it be because of gender, sexual orientation, race, it can be unfair treatment, it can be favoritism. All those things can fall underneath unprofessionalism and none of them are acceptable. The work experience that I have is mainly with the restaurant business so far, so those will be the examples that I'm going to use. So let's say you have a general manager who's in charge of an entire restaurant and then that general manager has other lower level managers below them and then there's crew members, so on and so forth. That general manager, they may favor some managers that are below them over other ones. It is unfortunate, but it does happen. When What makes it unprofessional is when it becomes apparent to other people below them, whether it be the, those other managers that they don't favor or crew members, or when they speak poorly on certain people for messing up when somebody that they favor might have messed up as well, but they don't speak poorly on them. Or when you compare people to other people, it's it's not right and it can make somebody feel bad about themselves and it's extremely unprofessional to do that. Other ways to be unprofessional might be sexual harassment, which does unfortunately happen um, in all sorts of businesses, but I have witnessed it in the restaurant business and it's very sad and sometimes things are done about it. You know, you might go to somebody above you, you might go to a, a manager, you might go to the top manager, you might go to corporate, you do report these things sometimes, but unfortunately when nothing's done about it, it does discourage people from from wanting to report it from here on out. And that's what makes it unprofessional is, is the fact that people higher up don't want to do anything about it. It's also unprofessional to sexually harass somebody. So please, 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 if you do see something, say something. A story that I would like to tell revolving around unfair treatment and unprofessionalism would be that recently a friend of mine actually had to walk to work in these storms that we've been having and so it was freezing outside and there were you know six inches of snow on the floor but he was told that we could not shut down and that it didn't matter that nobody else was going to be there when he got there he needed to walk in a mile and a half to work because he has no car and he needed to go and work by himself and get things done and when he tried to call above his boss thinking that it would do something, the person above his boss unfortunately even told him that she did not care. And that is unprofessional, that is showing that you care more about the business than the people working for you and those are literally the backbone. Overall, my goal and my point that I'm hoping that I'm making is that unfair treatment and unprofessionalism in the workplace are a real problem, whether it be in the restaurant business or anywhere else. And I would love to see this changed. And my suggestions on changing that are as far as, you know, sexual harassment, like I said, if you see something, say something, or if it's happening to you, please don't be afraid to report it because this is, it's serious and it doesn't need to be stopped. And if it's discrimination as well, please say something because there will be somebody out there at some level who does care about this and should put a stop to it. A suggestion that I really have is to be the change that you would like to see. So say you see yourself moving up in the company that you're within, and along the way you are able to report things, you are able to be the change and talk to the people around you and make those tweaks that need to be made that you've noticed along your way, then it would be a beautiful thing for you to be able to fix all of that that you noticed on your way up. And that's all I have to say. Thanks for listening.